internet has made the younger generation spend endless hours sitting with their computer and lose touch with their surroundings. Australian Chinese migrant Warren Lam has a vision to help young people develop a healthy lifestyle and respect their Chinese culture and traditions. He established the Australian Xinghui Chinese Culture Centre in Sydney, which is a non-profit organisation to promote Chinese culture. Chinese culture has a history of 5,000 years. I hope I can be one of the people to promote Chinese culture. And I also hope Australian Chinese can inherit this wonderful culture. My ancestors were from Xinhui, a city district in southern China, so I also want to introduce Xinhui to the local communities. Born in 1957 in Hong Kong, Warren Lam came to Australia in 1983 with only 500 Australian dollars and two bags of luggage. He worked in a fur factory and used his leisure time to sell belts in Paddy's Market. Without his own car, he carried heavy boxes of belts travelling by public transport to the market. He earned his first bucket of gold by doing well in the belt wholesale business. Then he met his Taiwanese wife, Daisy Lam, who had a rich experience in the clothing garment industry. Daisy has taken on the role as a strong and hard-working woman behind a successful man. We always were as a team. For all the most important things in our life, we always agree with each other for the decision that we make. Warren is the kind of person that always have new ideas, and my job is to refine all details. In a word, my role is to reduce Warren's worry as much as I can. Warren changed his business direction in the early 90s. He invested in door locks and related building materials, but faced losses in the first three years. However, the business started to turn a profit with his belief in hard work and being able to adapt to changes when required. Earn money in a legal and honest way. I think honesty and integrity are the most important. Besides promoting Chinese culture, Warren and Daisy are involved in various charity missions for the local community, such as supporting the Fraser Park Football Club. I think that playing football is one of the best things you can do, just any sport in general, but football for me is my major. Um, I love being here because so, you get to hang out with your friends while you play, so it's perfect and you get the health benefits much more enjoyable than sitting at home on the internet by yourself all day. But Warren's really inspired me because he comes to all of our matches and he supports us and any support is just really good to have as a player and the amount he puts into this club and the amount he puts time into us really makes you keep wanting to play. Warren supports the club to help young people follow a healthy lifestyle. I want to help young people to get into sport and follow the gym. Warren and Daisy are still working more than 12 hours a day and keep looking for interesting opportunities to expand their business. They recently set up a fund to help Australia's young people start up their own businesses. Cultivation of the next generation of young people to help them to start a business to help them set up their dream career. They both believe it is always more blessed to give than to receive. I believe if you take benefit from the society, then one should give back to the society. I'm a very lucky person. Besides making a living, I have the ability to help people who need help. This kind of happiness, you cannot buy with money. From his hometown in China to his new life in Australia, Sydney is now home. Warren loves his country and believes in the importance of making a contribution to society. We need to live in harmony with each other and therefore contribute to this country together. Mm -hmm.